Welcome to Module 3, Unit 2 of uh, Entrepreneurship and Innovation. Unit 2 is looking at copyright laws in Nigeria. Intellectual property uh, refers to creation of the mind. It's of somebody's imagination, somebody's uh, uh, you know vision. It's from the uh, from somebody's mind, from somebody's intellect, from somebody's brain. So it's very personal and belongs to the creator. They include inventions. They include literary work like books, novels, artistic work, designs, symbols, names, not just uh, if your name is uh, Ahmed or John, you go and register John. No, we are talking about business names that are unique. If probably take a single name, somebody is answering to go and register, nobody will accept it from you. Uh, so we are talking about business name. This is probably why if you want to register a business name, they say they want to search to make sure nobody has exactly the name. If they, anybody has similar name, they want you to do some adjustments before they could accept it. It has to be unique. There are images too. Logo. You can be doing something and have your logo. If you want to register it, they have to search to make sure no other person has it. If it has to be unique, that is where creativity comes in. So these are the intellectual The Nigerian Copy Act, uh, Copyright Act, Cap C28, it makes provision for the definition of a copyright, the protection of somebody's registered uh, intellectual property, the transfer, if you will. If you want to transfer it, the ownership to somebody else, the infringement, the remedy and penalty for any of these. The, there is copyright in literary works, in musical works, in artistic works, cinematograph films sound recordings, broadcasts, and uh, other ancillary matters. So, if you have any of them, provided it is registered. If you don't register them, anybody can copy them. Uh, you see the music people are playing. Sometimes people replicate other people's music. But because they are not registered, uh, there is nothing you can do about it. You can only get protection if you do the proper registration. Finally, in setting up a business or in producing something new, it is desirable that you know your right if you need to be protected. Identify the existing laws to protect your rights. Bye for now.